Welcome to What is R Studio? This video is strictly aimed at the beginners in the class, uh, those who have uh, never heard of R Studio in particular uh, and limited experience uh, starting to work with R, telling it how to load data, that kind of thing. Um, if that isn't you, feel free to skip this. It's nothing required about this video. Um, but if you feel like you could use a refresher or this is new information to you, stay tuned. Um, so first, let's talk about what RStudio is. So I had you download R and RStudio. R is the programming language. RStudio is not R. RStudio is an environment that helps make programming in R less painful. Uh, so let's open up RStudio and see what it is. So when you open up RStudio, this is what a fresh open is going to look like. If you've never been in RStudio before, it can seem a little overwhelming. There's all of these different windows. We're just going to focus on the essentials of what you're going to need for the class, um, things that will be very useful, handy, necessary. Right now we have uh, the standard up in the left-hand corner. You see the standard tabs for doing common uh, tasks. Uh, and we'll get we'll use a few of those. Some of those you won't need to use. The main feature of our studio are these windows that uh, are displayed across the screen. Uh, we'll start with this one on the left here. This is the console. This is R. So everything here that you're looking at is R Studio. Uh, this window on the left lets you stare straight into the heart of R. So this prompt down here is how you can give it code. So I can tell it two plus two, and it tells me four, which is good. This console window is where R will tell us when things aren't working. So it is important to keep an eye on it and what information is coming back from R um, when we send it code to run. These other two windows are things that are just make life easier for us. Um, this one down here with the tabs of files, plots, packages, help, and viewer. Right now it's set on the files so that uh, I can navigate my files and open any, any files I want to look at through RStudio. This plots tab is another one that we'll use a lot because when we plot things in R, those plots will often pop up in this tab over here so that we can see uh, what R is, is generating for us. This environment window on top, as we start programming in R, things will start to pop up there of what R is running and what it thinks those answers are. We will see examples of that when we move on to loading data and, and making R do things. 